its Bayou and Cafe menu. Kinesin will be presented today. We will talk about Kinesin Discovery, Kinesin Structure, Kinesin Function, and Quiz Game. I'm Dr. Bayemet, Cellular and Molecular Biologist. Hi everybody, welcome to Biomed Cafe channel. In this channel, complex biological and medical contents are presented in a simple, classified and summarized form. Kinesin discovery, they saw something other didn't see. The first kinesin was discovered in 1985 based on their motility in cytoplasm excluded from the action of the squid. Kinesin characteristics. It is a motor protein that is capable of moving along the macrotubules. It is ATPase. Its movements are energy consuming. It moves from the negative to the positive end of the macrotubule. It carries cargo from the center of the cell to the periphery of the cell. It's anterior grade transport. Kinesin structure. Kinesin has two heavy chains or car HCS and two light chains or car LCS in its structure. Heavy chains. They form a protein dimer. Every heavy chain has two parts. Head. Head is globular, ATPase domain, the motor domain. It connects by a short, flexible neck to the stack. It binds to the microtubules. It has two binding sites. One for the microtubule, the other for ATP. A stalk. A stalk is long, central alpha helical coil coil domain. It ends in tail domain. Light chain. Light chains are named tail. The tail binds to the cargo. Kinesin movement. Name of the movement is hand over hand or walking. Type of movement is unidirectional. One head binds to the microtubule and then the other head binds. Thus, is each step the leading head becomes the trailing head while the trailing head becomes the leading head. Passageways are beta tubulins of macrotubule. Fuel is one ATP at each step. ATP binding, ATP hydrolysis that power each step, and ADP release that propelling the head forwards to the next binding site change the conformation of microtubule binding domain. Then change the orientation of the neck linker with respect to the head. Finally, motion of kinesin occurs. Kinesin movement steps. Step 1. The trailing head releases phosphate derived from the hydrolysis of ATP. Step 2. The trailing head detaches from the microtubule and rotates into its right far displaced unbound state. Step 3. The leading head binds ATP which causes the neck linker to duck to it. Step 4. The trailing head 
moves our deleting it into a position further aligned the marquee view in the direction of travel. The trailing cat remains unbound. Step 5. The ATP in the leading head is hydrolyzed. And the final step, the trailing head releases its ADP bias to the microtubule and becoming the leading head. You can see all steps of kinesin movement together. Kinesin function. It transports cellular cargo, especially cell organelles such as mitochondria and molecules aligned microtubules. It supports several cellular functions including mitosis and meiosis. Kinesin regulation. Kinesin tends to have low basal enzymatic activity. Kinesin can be inhibited by the binding to cargo adapters or cargo associated proteins. Kinesin and dynein are two motor proteins. Now I want to compare kinesin with dynein. Function Kinesin plays a role in intracellular transport, but dynein plays a role in movement of organelles chromosomes and beating of cilia and flagella. Movement aligned microtubules. Kinesin moves towards plus end of microtubules, but dynein moves towards minus ends of microtubules. Type of transport. Kinesin has anthrograde transport, but dynein has with the great transport. Direction of movement. Kinesin carries cargo from center to periphery of the cell, but dynein carries cargo from periphery to center of the cell. And a structure. Kinesin has two heavy chain and two light chain, but dynein has two or three heavy chain, intermediate, light intermediate and light chains. Similarities between dynein and kinesin. They are two motor proteins. Both move along the microtubules. They aid in material transfer within the cell. Both proteins are important in cell division. Both proteins are ATP hydrolysis, and both their movement is unidirectional. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to this channel, and if you like the contents of this video, please like it. Now it's time to the quiz game. I have put the link to the quiz game in the description of this video. Download it for free and enjoy it. Until the next video, bye!